to grow up as one of those kids who had runny noses, who would run around around in oversized underwear in the village. Because I think that even her family supports her. And so could it be that she's their breadwinner and she's the reason that they feed? We don't even know her journey and how she got it. I don't want to beat her because I don't know the kind of beating that she received before she got onto doing these things. But I, I, you know, when it starts going into being stupid for publicity, I, you've lost me there. I'm not what saying carry the Bible. I'm not saying do a wear a suit, you know, and do a descent. Even show a little bit of skin, you could still be famous. Reflects it, it affects us as women. When we get into a relationship with someone and they are viewing us in a particular way, that's because they have some preconceived notions about women. When you go and depict us like that, now you are spreading your legs this way. So, and every day you see women coming and complaining about relationships with men. But already we've given them the idea that we have such a sexually permissive society and behavior in 2024. Maybe those women who are supporting this, maybe, or maybe they are lesbians. I don't know what it is. And so they, they, they're not thinking as far as how this impacts us as women who want to have good relationships with men. Am I communicating with you? Yeah, I, I, I see how you are tying it in.